Hello, my name is Jake Shepard. These are two contrasting monologues. One is from Red by John Logan. The other is from Twelve Angry Men by Reginald Rose. <laughs> you go in from 52nd. Go up some stairs to the restaurant. You hear the place before you see it. Glasses clinking, silverware, voices hushed at first, but louder as you get closer. It's a desperate sound, like forced gaiety at gunpoint. You go in, feel underdressed, feel inadequate, feel too goddamn Jewish for this place. Give your name, pretty waitress snaps for a maitre d' who snaps for a head waiter who snaps for a captain who leads you through the restaurant to your table, heads turning to everyone, looking at everyone else all the time like predators. Who are you? Do I know you? Do I need to fear you? Do I need to acquire you? You look around. Everyone else seems to belong here. Men with elegant silver hair and women with capes and gloves. Someone in a uniform brings you a menu. It's filled with things you've never heard of. Quail eggs in aspic, suckling pigs under glass. You feel lost. And then you begin to hear it, what other people are saying around you, voices, it's the chatter of the monkey and the barking of jackals, it's not human, and then everyone is laughing about this or that, and everyone's on this charity board or that charity board, and everyone's going and jetting off to this place or that place, and everyone's laughing and talking about this or that, and all they do is chatter and bark and click and clack with their silverware and snarl and bite. And in that place, there, will live my paintings for all of eternity. <laughs> I wonder, do you think they'll ever forgive me? Everything. Every single thing that went on in that courtroom, but I mean everything, says he's guilty. Do you think I'm an idiot or something? You're not going to intimidate me, you lousy bunch of bleeding hearts. Every goddamn thing! Somebody say something. Why don't you take the thing with the old man, huh? The old man who lived there and heard everything. Or, 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 or the lady with the glass. You can't prove she didn't have her glasses on. Well, what do you want? That's it. That's the whole case. Or take the thing that the kid said to his father. The phrase was, I'm going to kill you. I don't care what kind of man that was. It was his father. That goddamn rotten kid. I know him. I know what they're like. What they do to you. How they kill you every single day. Jeez. Why can't anyone see? Why am I the only one that can see? I can feel the knife going in. <laughs>